hello good morning all today in this video we are going to discuss regarding how to inherit a model in Udo. so currently in the screen you are seeing Odoo version 15 community edition where we are continuing our Odoo 15 development tutorials so in the previous video we have successfully shown you how to generate a module using scaffold command in Odoo. so if i go to the pie charm here i have my custom add-ons folder and here you can see we have got a new module called om Odoo inheritance which we have generated using scaffold command so what i will be doing is that i'll be showing you how to inherit a existing model so if i go to the ui so we know that by default odoo contains different modules like sales crm purchase accounting invoicing stock etc and there might be some need where we have to inherit any of these models and to do some operations like either adding a new field or inheriting an existing function or changing the properties of an existing field or for adding a new function so there will be a lot of use cases and Odoo developers must know how to inherit a model in Odoo so what I will be doing is that I'll show you how we can inherit the sale order model in Odoo so the sale dot order model is defining inside Odoo sales module so I'll be inheriting this model inside our OM Odoo inheritance module so let's see how we can do that so first of all I'll copy the model name that I need to inherit sale order and what I will do I'll check inside Odoo source code so this is Odoo source code and find in path and I will search for this model inside python i will search for the name the definition where i need to understand where this model is defined initially so i'll put double in comma and here you can see this is the model definition you can see name sale order and if i open this you can see this model is introduced from sales module so you have to copy this module that is you have to copy this module because for our module you have to add this module as a dependent module so inside om odoo inheritance module i specified my module is depending on sales module so that's done so you have to give proper dependency then what you have to do we have to inherit the model sale dot order so i'll go to the models folder here we already have model.py with empty file so as i am going to inherit sale order i will rename it to sale order py sale order dot py and in it file i will import the same sale order from dot import sale order and this model file has been already imported in the outer init file so we have successfully created a file and change the name to the model name now what we have to do we have to inherit so let me take a sample from the upper patient tag so i'll copy this sample and i will put it here inside sale order py from dot odo import these things are imported api fields and models then you have to class name or you have to inherit which model we have to inherit sale order so copy that name and here you have to specify the model name so instead of name so name attribute is used when we define a new model but right now we are inheriting so you have to use inherit key so this is how we can inherit a model just add inherit equal to specify the model name and change the class name to related with the model name so i'll put the class name as sale order so this is how we can inherit a model in odoo so let's see what happens if i restart and upgrade or install om odoo inheritance module so i'll go to the ui and i'll go to the apps menu and i'll search for om odoo inheritance and i'll click on upgrade so you can see the module is getting upgraded and there is no errors and if i come back to the apps again and if i search for that and if i click on module info and let me activate the debug mode so i'll go to the settings and i will activate the developer mode so you can see the debug mode is activated i'll come back to the apps 
search for Odoo inheritance module info in the technical data you can see our module is depending on sales and nothing no created menus no reports <coughs> and basic information from the manifest can be seen here so this is how you can inherit a model in Odoo so the inheritance is done now if you need to define the fields you can do like this here we can see if you need to define new fields you can do here if you need to define a new function you can define here test function you can do like this so that will be added to the corresponding model so this is how you can inherit a model in odoo so i hope you understood this video if you like the video please do click the like button subscribe the channel and press the bell icon so that you will be notified regarding all the upcoming updates so in the following videos we will be showing you how to inherit field how to inherit an existing function and so on and so so that's it for the day have a nice day thank you